Hi everybody, I'm Sky from Sky TV One, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make these amazing and delicious mince pies. Oh my gosh, I love mince pies. They taste so festive and so yummy. I just, I just love them. So I am going to be showing you how to make the pastry for the mince pies, as I have already done a mince meat recipe, and you can go onto my channel to find out how to make your very own tasty mince meat, you know, and your very own mince pie. So everything here is homemade except for the ingredients. Let's get started. The ingredients are 225 grams of plain flour. I also have some extra for when we are rolling out the pastry. I have a, well, I have some salt here, but you only actually need a quarter of a teaspoon. I have some chilled water here and you are going to be using three to four to five tablespoons of that. And you will also be needing 85 grams of treks. And you will be needing a whisked egg, any size. So here I have a large bowl and a sieve, and I'm going to put all of the 225 grams into the sieve, into the bowl. It looks like a winter wonderland when you've done this. It looks like really, really nice soft snow. Now we're going to add one quarter of a teaspoon of salt. Like that. We're just going to mix the flour and salt together. of salt and flour you are going to add your 85 grams of Torex if I can get it out <laughs> there we go and then you're going to use your fingers to rub it together to make it like breadcrumbs which is going to get the fingers like this just get a little bit of the Torex and a little bit of flour and rub them together like this and it will make a kind of bread crummy, fine bread crumbs basically. So here we have a knife, I have my bread crummy looking tricks and plain flour and uh, salt and I also have a jug of water. Now with the water I'm going to add three to four tablespoons. Now I'm going to just start off with three and if I need any more I can just gradually go up. I'm going to use the knife to kind of blend it in. <laughs> going to wrap this in some cling film to put in the fridge for about 8 to 10 minutes. So I've left my pastry in the fridge for about 10 minutes. It's nice now. And we are going to put some flour on the on my board. I have a board and I have a, also a rolling pin. I've just put some flour on the board just to make sure the pastry doesn't stick and I'm about to pull the pastry out. Just round it slightly, put a sprinkle over flour on there and roll out. You want it very, very, very thin. Like, you want like really thin. Thank you. 
to cut our little pastry round circle things out I am using just a medium kind of like cup so here I have a tray to put my mince pies in these like places to put mince pies in are very shallow and they're really nice because they're like bite size and you can have sometimes like more than one and they taste like nicer because you have a smaller amount okay so i'm just going to get one of my round circles and put it in there like that make sure you don't push it in too much because you don't want like any fingerprints because that could make the, the actual pastry, pastry thinner which means it, it will like break like that and then you just do that to all of them okay so I've rolled my excess pastry and I'm using two cookie cutters today. I'm using just a round one which is going to fit over the top of my mince pie and I also have just a very small star which will look really cute. So now we are going to fill our little pies with our mince meat. This is the homemade one that I was saying about earlier and um, I have a video on my channel and you can find that. There we go, cute mince pies. And now we are going to get that whisked edge that we had earlier. And we're just going to glaze the tops of our mince pies just to give it that golden glisten. And make sure your oven is 200 centigrade, fan oven 180 centigrade, and gas mark six. And they're ready to go in there for about 20 to 25 minutes and it'll be done. I really hope you've enjoyed this video today. Please have an amazing Christmas and look out for more videos and festive videos on my channel, Sky TV One. Bye!